Here in lesson one, we're going to talk about knowing and desiring God. Because the Catholic faith is first and foremost about God. He's created us and he invites us to share in his life. And so we must begin with him. We have to acknowledge that God exists before we can begin to have a relationship with him. Scripture says, whoever would draw near to God must believe that he exists and that he rewards those who love him. Unfortunately, we live in an increasingly agnostic and even atheistic culture. Many people operate under the presumption that God doesn't exist at all and that we shouldn't even really talk about him in public. They think religion should be confined to church groups or private religious practices. Others reject God outright for theoretical reasons. They claim God can't exist because there's evil in the world. Or they say that modern science, for various reasons, has made the idea of God obsolete. So since we live in this context, in this environment, we need to begin with the question of God, with the basic questions about his existence, before we delve deeper into the Catholic faith. We know that reason alone can come to see that God exists and some basic things about him. Philosophers throughout the centuries have offered proofs, various different ways of demonstrating God's existence. And some of the most famous proofs are those offered by St. Thomas Aquinas, our great guiding light and theologian. When it comes to God, processes of reasoning aren't enough to establish a relationship with him. He has so much more to tell us about himself, so much more than even the most brilliant minds throughout the centuries could ever reach on their own. For this reason, he's revealed himself, and he gives us the supernatural virtue of faith, which is what we'll be discussing in our next lesson.